What up? What up? What up? It is, what day is it? Day 48. Keeping it going, going to place and playing a man. I kind of had a... Um, I worked af out after work and then I was gonna go play some football by myself. But when I got to the court, it was busy because five-year-olds gonna have some practice and they were gonna use the entire field. And it feels great, it felt great, it did not. And then I came home, tried to do some French. I was really bad. And I know now I should have done it myself because the pictures on the download is not making any sense. And also I reread the article and it said a big part about the learning stuff, learning process was to get the pictures and then get an association with or make an association with the picture and the word. So I'm missing out on a lot of the learning process. But I don't think that would have been any, or it would have been entertaining to have French Fridays with me just searching for images. So I, I made the right decision for the videos and then the wrong decision for my learning experience. But, but, just gonna keep it on a rolly. I'm thinking about kind of trying to change the angles of the videos. And then I can be like over here and change the angle. Maybe it will make it a bit more interesting. I don't know, dude. I just gotta try it out, man. And it's gonna be a bit more fun to edit maybe as well. To try and make the different stuff comprehensible or what the word is, I don't know. I'm going to include some of the uh, sketchy stuff I'm working on. I think that might be make it a bit more interesting with the daily videos just to show off what I'm thinking and what I wanna make. Hey! What? What do you mean what? What do you mean what do I mean? Do you not know what what means? Of course I know what what means. But why are you saying what? You know what? How how can I know? All you said is hey. Well, do you know what hey means? Uh, hello? No, not hello, or yes, hello, but I mean, when I say hey, like that, you should know with the tone what I'm asking about. No, I really do not. You ate my sandwich, dude. <laughs> I, did, I didn't take your sandwich, dude. Yes, you did. I know it was you. You are the only one here, dude. Well, you mean... <laughs> Here, it was, you know, it was a raccoon. He just came in and, you know, the door was open and, you know, the sandwich was gone. Just, just, dude, just buy me a new sandwich, please. <sighs> yeah, fine, I'll buy you a new one. Thank you. So as you see, it's a bit, still a bit rough around the edges. But as you saw in the little clip, just trying to make a conversation work between two people in the same apartment. But then, because now I'm just thinking about it and... If I start to write some stuff down as well, it might uh, be better and it might be more fluent. But the good thing about filming different angles is that it doesn't have to be every line uh, fluently. Because uh, I can cut it and change the angles and maybe make it more interesting. Who knows? This is more. This is a bit of a test to see if it's more interesting to change the angles and continue the conversation. Maybe I don't know. What I want to do is like sit there and talk about some stuff and then show off like a different angle or a clip I've been doing and then talk talk about it uh, more like after I show this. So I have to work on how I can present that in a, in a coherently way. So we'll see. And then, we're gonna see about that. I'll sit down and try to edit it now. Hippity, hoppity, see you on the shoppity. Whippy!